Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to show you what's in this cutie. I do have a what's in my bag in her on my channel from when I first got her last summer, but I chose to carry her today. So I'm gonna show you guys bag of the day. Jesus Christ, does she look washed out? Ugh. I do not like the way the Brahmin, where is it at, it's behind me, this piece. I don't like the way this sticks out, y'all. I took it off the bag and I put it on one of our O-rings and put it back on to see how I would like it. And I just don't like it, y'all. I don't like how far it sticks out from the bag. And what's crazy is when the handles are down, it lays okay. But when the handles are up, it's just, mm -mm. it just wasn't working for me, y'all. It just wasn't working. I left it on there last time, but I just couldn't do it this time. I couldn't do it. So if you're new here, this is the Brahmin in the large Duxbury size. This color or print colorway pattern is called Pink Cobra. As you can see, I do have this gold charm on the front that just says Miss MRS. It is from um, Victoria's Secret. I had not used it in a while, so I decided to put it on here. I normally have the strap. As you can see, it is hella wonky. It was still bundled on the inside of the bag. I had not used it at all, but I did decide to go ahead and pull it out and put it on the outside in case I needed to throw her on my shoulder. It was already there. Um, normally with my hand carry bags, I do already have the strap attached to my Brahmins. I had not attached the strap, so I decided to go ahead and attach it this time and I'm gonna roll it up like I normally do and put it on the inside so it won't look like that so anywho let's get into what is in the bag Move my basket over still got stuff in it from my last bag I carry that I didn't get a chance to show you guys I do not have things all pretty and sexy in in nice perfect positions everything is just in there so start in the back pocket clipped onto that pocket I do have my taser I'm gonna put that in there and then I have my keys which is the if you know you know six key holder it does have house key car key everybody key all the keys let's see what else is in here chapstick I do have the smaller chapstick I've been carrying my coach tabby 26 and 20 lately so I didn't want my larger chapstick in there taking up more room I have my favorite lip gloss right now which is the Fenty Beauty uh, Fenty glow I have my pink hand sanitizer. Let's see. I have my clipper from Amazon in case I don't have a chair to put my bag in. I think that's everything. Yep, everything in the back pocket. So then we have the wallet. This wallet does match the bag. I want to say this one is called Veronica, but I might be wrong. I'll check on the inside. But this one matches the bag perfectly. It is a large wallet, again, in that pink cobra print. Make sure nobody is revealing themselves. All right, so inside the wallet looks like this. You have your four credit card slots over here. You have your other credit card slots here. I'm not counting right now. You have a um, slip pocket behind there. There is no slip pocket here. You do have two pockets on this side. Let me fold this up. You have two pockets on this side. The first one is kind of like a um, like a slip pocket. You can put where you want. I have some folded up cash in there. Inside the zipper pocket, I think I put our health insurance cards. And then in the back, I have my additional cards that you know couldn't fit in any of the other slots. But this pocket actually goes all the way down the wallet so if you're new here my fingertip is literally at the bottom right there it's all the way down the bottom so let me cover up ID I could show you guys my hand is literally all the way in there so if you're new here definitely a great wallet to have especially if you want to um, you know have somewhere to put your receipts or other papers let me see if I could find the tag real quick I think it might be in here here it is all right, so, oh, I was right. It is the Veronica. I got this last year for my birthday, so I couldn't quite remember the name, but I guess I was right in my guess. So yeah, so this wallet is called the Veronica. So all my wallet things are in there. And then I've used this little um, pink and black Juicy Couture pouch. I'm using this as my um, black lace pouch. So if you're not new here, y'all know how I have my got to have it essentials in a little pouch I can just grab and go. So I have all of those things. I have my artificial tears I use as re-wetting drops for my contacts. I have my um, nail file from the Dollar Tree. One liner in an organza bag. I have a small CeraVue lotion. I have my power bank from Amazon. I have a Q-tip and I have a small chapstick. Again, this pouch is one, oh, and a piece of candy. 
and breast strips. <laughs> this pouch is one that I can grab and go and toss in a smaller bag. I have not tried to put this particular pouch inside of the Tabby 26, so I don't know if it would fit, but I know I could easily move these things over to a smaller pouch if this one didn't, but it may. Uh-oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. That's the only thing I don't like about these organza bags is I was worried about something like this happening at some point. Come on, let go, let go, let go. Okay, it's not letting go. I will deal with that later. All right, so back to using my Victoria's Secret um, key straps or wristlet straps, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. I know a lot of people like to use theirs for their keys, but since I do the six key holder, when I am in the mood to use these and I have a large enough bag, I like to put it on my AirPods. So I have it on my third generation AirPods and I do have one in my ear because I was listening to music on my phone. So let's see here. Next, I have the corner wristlet from the Coach Outlet. This one is in the color, um, I want to say Cerise is what it might be called. It's like a berry-ish hot pink color. Yeah, it's Cerise. So it's like a berry-ish hot pink color. I like using these for my lady pouch if you are new here. So I have a pack of tissues for in the bathroom stall. I have my larger sheen pouch with my liners. I have the standard sheen pouch with floss sticks and Q-tips. I have some soap sheets two lady wipes, a couple of expandable washcloths, and a small spray bottle from Sheen for the bathroom. So let me just put these goodies back in here. I don't really like to put these in the basket loose and all over the place. Pick that back up. I was in my MCM Liz tote um, the last three or so days, and I really wanted to film what's in my bag, but work was working yesterday, and um, I was just in a mood, y'all. I was really in a mood when I got off, so I'm sorry. I didn't make do in that one. Um, this is the Dunienberg um, coin case, I think it's called. Um, these are new to me, so forgive me if I'm wrong, but I want to say it's called a coin case. I don't know if they put it. Yeah, they don't put on the tag. Um, this is what I like to call a hot pink color, but the color is called... Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> it's called hot pink. It's like a pretty fuchsia Barbie pink color. In the front zipper, I don't have anything. It's just completely empty. In the back zipper, I don't have anything except the tags themselves. So I would know what color it is. And then I'm using it for change. So I just have all of my coins in there. Nothing else. Let's see. Then I am using my Nolita 19 in that beautiful bold pink color. I'm in the boutique. The sun is doing what it does and it's on its way down as you can see those lines from the blinds. But I really want to film in here because I know the bags in the background is some really pretty eye candy. I tend to love it watching others videos so I figured I would film in here today. But using this as my catch-all so I just have my standard catch-all things in here. I've got the flat pack of tissues. I don't have anything in that back slip pocket. I have my usual clear um, glitter case from Sheen for my little first aid stuff and some extra contacts. And y'all, I could have sworn I owned this case in purple and I can't find it anywhere. I had the itch earlier today to switch these into my purple pouch and I cannot find it. Let me show y'all because I have the other ones right here. I also have it in the blue teal color and then I also have it in a hot pink color and I could have sworn I had purple sitting in the drawer right next to it and it was not there. So I might have to move some other pouches around and see if maybe I just overlooked it. I have a tiny bottle from Tatcha, excuse me, from Sheen with some Tatcha moisturizer. I switched to this pill case. I just had the itch to see that pretty purple flower. So I just have pain meds and Benadryl in there. I have my purple nail clipper from one of the timber stores tiny purple combs from the dollar tree i have a ponytail holder and i need to add another one y'all i put one in my hair in the car and did not replace it just got a bunch of icebreakers mints in this cute little purple case from the dollar tree and then on the other side you guys those two little credit card slots i decided to tuck my coupons in there so i have one for bath and body works and i think two yeah from victoria's secret and i just decided to tuck that in there so just gonna slide these things back in here so just the basics, nothing extra. I took out all the things that I just really was not reaching for. Um, my hair is curly right now, so I could take out that comb, but I'm just gonna leave it. You guys, I went to the coach outlet to pick up some 
just new release pieces and of course I'll show those in another video but I have wanted one of these pouches for like two years I don't even know what I want to put in it y'all I have absolutely no plans for it but I just think it's adorable so I've wanted one for a long time I may pick up some of the other colors as I grab more perfumes and fragrances but they did have this one the outlet which I thought was new because I have never seen the gift sets in my outlet but they did have it so I just have the perfume in here it's the floral one um, so I just have the small perfume that came with the gift set in there and then the other tiny little uh, YSL Libri um, perfume I normally have loose in the catch-all I just put that in there so really extra don't really need this in there but I just got this like two days ago and I just really wanted to use it let's see here we have my tiny baby planner y'all I really wanted to get a different one that did not have the big back pocket that I do not use but I don't know y'all I ordered one it came and I just did not like it I am amazed sometimes at the smallest detail that I'm just I'm picky I'm so picky I'm like nope that's going back so I ordered one and the spine was it reminds me of the Louis Vuitton MM agenda which is weird because on that agenda I don't have a problem with it but the spine was very boxy it wasn't rounded the way that this one is um, the color was gorgeous but I just couldn't get past the spine y'all it's just it was that serious and then the other one that I wanted um the Filofax um pastel pink I think it's called it was like $127 and then it said it's going to take four to six weeks from Japan um no thank you I'll wait so still using my mini planner and I guess I'm going to be in that cover for a while because I don't see another one I like I'm super picky this is my um, digital business card. Instead of carrying business cards, I have this one. So these can just be scanned for Instagram or YouTube. I have a safety tool over here. This purple key is not a key. It's a knife. And then I have three gorgeous charms. One with my sister, my mom, my bestie, and my tripod sisters. So that is my little keychain. And then I have uh -oh, a couple of things. So I have this cute little kiss lock pouch that came from Sheen. Thanks to Miss Toya sharing it on her channel. I ran and grabbed it months, months, months ago. <laughs> I've had it a minute. I think I've used it a couple times too. So usual fashion for me, the kiss lock pouch is my favorite to use for my candy and a couple of cough drops. So that's all that's in there. Do have my readers in here. I'm carrying them faithfully, but luckily I have not had to use them. I don't know y'all. I guess my eyes just really needed an eye appointment because mm -hmm, I have not had to use them, but I keep them just in case I'd rather have them than not have them and then I'm branching out and you know living life on the edge <laughs> so I have my sunglasses in this little pouch that came with one of the pairs of sunglasses I bought the kids off Amazon who knows how long ago I've just had this pouch in my collection for a while at the bottom I just have the little um you know the little cloth you wipe them off with which I'm putting my fingers all over them right now just have one of those little cloths tucked in the bottom same stuff I usually have in the hard case but I did recently pick these up from coach with the new release of that new purple yes I grabbed some pieces so if you wanted to know the answer is absolutely so I'll show those in another video but these were called let me see yeah there it is they were called purple tortoise let me see if I can get that part on the screen right there get it clear Hold on, y'all. There you go. Purple tortoise. So I grabbed them. They look a little. They looked a little darker online, but I was hoping that they were a pretty color in, per in person. Jesus, all the peas. I can't talk. But they are. They're really, really cute. I actually like them on me. I do still prefer the shape of my favorite shades that y'all always see me show. But I'm branching out a little bit, and I thought these were really cute. And I was not about to let them go by being purple. So I did go ahead and add these to cart off the website and I do think they're still available and let me see what else oh so the big part of the bag is completely empty who knows what this white thing is completely empty in the big part the back pocket is also completely empty it does have that zipper pocket on the back if you're new here or new to Brahmin on the other side of the large Duxbury you do have a couple of slip pockets you have a key keeper you have um, a pen loop here, which I just have my favorite Villa Beautiful pen right now. Is that pretty purple one with the pretty stones. I have a pen gem pen should I need to sign a receipt and need a ballpoint um, ink tip. I have my lotion from Bath and Body Works. And then in the other pocket, I just have my mattifying powder that I've been using faithfully for, I don't know y'all, we might be going on almost a month now. So this is the Fenty Beauty um, mattifying or 
blotting <laughs> powder that I love to use on my face whether I'm wearing makeup or not and I think that's everything except the tag so if anybody was curious or new this is the tag it's the large Duxbury satchel I don't know why the L is miss missing on that is this supposed to be called a satch a satche I don't know but as you can see the color is called pink cobra ombre I did get this last year in June for my birthday from my sexy handsome hubby with the matching wallet so yeah, you guys, that's everything that's in there. In the back pocket is nothing. When I was out the house, where is my phone? Oh, tucked in my waist. When I was out the house, I do slap my phone right in that pocket. It fits, no problem. I do have the 12. I am obsessed with the purple. This case is clear. My phone itself is actually purple, and I'm obsessed. I refuse to replace her until she dies. So, I slap mine in there, no problem, but I have watched other Brahmin videos, and people are able to fit the larger phones in there. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Um, just want to show you guys real quick what I am carrying in my bag, and I'll see everybody in the next video. Bye!